Real quick, I just want to mention that I have a Twitch channel I stream on, and if any of you guys are looking for some extra content, I will leave the link down to that in the description. Any support would be greatly appreciated. Alright, listen up boys. Just when you thought there was no more S-tier hand cannon videos coming this season, you know what I had to do. There's another one because, honestly, this hand cannon deserves it. Now you guys can feel free to agree or disagree, but the hand cannon I'm talking about is none other than the Nation of Beasts. Now I know at first it's kind of like, okay, Grav, come on, you're reaching here. This is not an S tier hand cannon. Well, honestly, I disagree because it can get a stupidly juiced perk combination of Zen moments and explosive payload. Now, of course, as you guys can see, my broadcast does not have that role. I have ambitious explosive because, you know, like I said, I, I mean, I just never got, I never got the role, all right? But if you do have a Zen Moment Explosive Nation of Beasts, consider yourself lucky because Explosive Payload, we already know, it's one of the best hand cannon perks in the game. Flinches people to Uganda. There is nothing like it, right? Bes besides Time Payload is like it too. But like, you guys get the point. And then Zen Moments, I mean, if you guys don't already know about it by now, on hand cannons, it literally deletes flinch from existence. You will not get flinched if you have that perk on. And if you're wondering how it compares to certain other hand cannons in the game, stat-wise, not exactly the greatest, but the perk combination definitely does make the gun. And honestly, I would still take it over Exalted Truth. I hate the way this thing feels, man. Anyways, though, that is pretty much everything I wanted to say about the Nation of Beasts. I'm going to be pairing it with an Imperial Decree, Dawnblade, Ophidians, and all these armor mods right here. I will say I do get really, really mad in the second game and take off Imperial Decree. So uh, just look out for that because in that second game, I was about to... I was about to pop a blood vessel, alright? That's all I'm gonna say, but uh, I'm not gonna spoil the video. Hope you guys enjoy. Yo, what is this spawn? I actually really do not like this. We're kind of like sandwiched. Okay, we got out of it, actually. I thought this guy was gonna jump up, but he's gonna hang back with his SMG. Yo, he's so one. Oh my god. I didn't expect that guy to literally be 1 HP, so I just did not have my hand cannon out at all. Another one to my left. What? Hold up, huh? Like, that doesn't reg? I don't understand. How do I miss that? Okay, this guy's actually brain dead. That actually makes no sense. Okay, we did choke one of our hand cannon shots right there, but it ended up being all good. It kind of does suck that we don't have Zen Moment on this roll because it would be a lot better if we did. We can't really push that. This guy does have Kill Clip. I'm actually hanging back, bro. This was the only guy in the lobby I checked because I knew he was a Titan, and I didn't want to. I didn't want to get fried by a PK Titan. I'm not going to lie, aping me makes no sense there, but okay. Well, I mean, I was going to say it made no sense, but uh, I guess it actually did because the other guy just didn't chow. Like, he just watched the one guy ape me, literally did not shoot him at all. That literally made no sense to me. No damage on that guy. Oh, dude, I thought we didn't kill him, bro. We, like, no-regged. Oh, my God, that was a nasty throwing knife. That was so ugly from both of us, but that throwing knife was actually pretty good. He is using DMT on a controller, though, which is kind of weird because I don't know, like... DMT is really just not that good on controller, but, you know, it's not too annoying to go against. Dude, this hand cannon is kind of smacking, though. One around here. I don't know what this guy has. SMG player. Dude, like, if my shot doesn't hit wall right there, we have that. Bro, it's really annoying because if I step literally, like, one more centimeter to the right, we get that kill. But, like, my shot, like, the wall literally just ate my shot, which was not good. Might be able to full send this kid. No, it's SMG kid. Damn. Having to fight PK's close range is just, just uh, definitely not what we're trying to do. This guy might think we're going this way. Hit him with a hand cannon. He's jumping there. Dude, if he would have somehow mapped me with like a shotgun from there, I would have been pissed. That's all I'm going to say. Bro, how many people are... Okay, there's five people in here. I guess it's just eternity. That's why it kind of feels really slow. But I, like, I'm not seeing that many people. This guy might shall. He's not going to actually because he has a multi mock. gonna shotgun that guy perfect this guy has the smg we're gonna grab heavy does he ape this he does that was actually so stupid i didn't really want to sort him but uh that was our best plan because he that is the smg kid dude oh my god we got our gun by outbreak Ooh, nice three tap okay man i i'm not gonna lie nation of beast does feel really good like i love the feel of this hand cannon and that's kind of weird because I really, like, I don't like energy hand cannons that much as is. Just because I feel like they're not as good as kinetics. But uh, this one's kind of an exception. I think we swing back around here because we can't go through the nade. And then... Shit, shut your ass up. 
But yeah, I really have no idea what I was doing against that one guy. Like, aping into some, where, uh, where somebody can lane you with the pulse is just never a good idea because they're going to beat you every single time. If you're aping, you're in the air. It's just not a good idea. Bro, I cannot find anybody in this lobby that isn't in a super, bro. It's so annoying, dude. Like, it's actually so cooked. So I think there's only like three or four people in here. multi mock kid. He's probably not going to reach out. No, he's not. We're out of ammo. Oh my god, that's bad. But we're good. We got the... Oh, dude, I can't die to this kid. I actually can't die to this kid. Get around the wall. Pop super. Does he still chase? He does. He's actually so dumb. He's so dumb for chasing that. No shots. We got that curve with the dawn. That is actually nasty. Throw one more. Nah, that's not going to get there. This guy is kill clip. We're not pushing. We're not pushing multi mock with kill clip. We're smarter than that. Retap that kid. Multi mock behind us. He's not pushing. Multi mock kid. Okay, I was about to say, Bungie, do not hold me like that. I knew I wasn't missing those shots. Come on, man. Like, bro, the only issue I had at that match was it was just so boring. And then we literally had a lobby with four people and one of them was using PKSMG. So anytime I chowed this guy, it was literally just a wrap, bro. It was not good. I wonder if this guy jumps up through here. I think he actually is. Yeah. Dude, oh, bro. Dude what is the hit reg in this game? What is that? Like, you can't tell me that's real. There's actually no way. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Bro, I can't. I'm so done with this, bro. I'm so done with this shit, man. Like, it should not take me 15 seconds after I hit, like... I hit my shotgun shot, and it doesn't reg until, like, 15 seconds later, man. This guy coming all the way through. Dude, I was about to say, if y'all don't reg my Imperial Decree shot, I actually don't know what to do. I really don't. Like, dude, I get a no reg again. I, I can't. I can't. Like, I actually don't understand. Is this an issue with the servers or what? Because, like, today when I've been playing, the amount of no regs is just ridiculous, dude. Like, it actually makes no sense. I'm, my gun not regging is just annoying. Makes me not want to play at all. Terrible shots from me really doesn't matter. Honestly, I don't even know what, what terrible shots look like from me anymore. Because sometimes I'd be hitting and then they just don't count until like a minute after. This guy's aping up. He's going all the way around. Dude, like, do you want to use primary at all, please? Okay, no. That guy does not want to use his primary, which is fine. But like, I don't understand why he's backpedaling to shotgun me so hard. Dude, like, what is that? Like, am I just not regging? Dude, I, I can't. I can't. This is actually, like, it's genuinely making me mad. Like, right there, we actually just missed our shotgun shot. But it's just so annoying. I know I'm complaining a lot this game, boys. But, like, the bugs we've had since Lightfall are just, like, they're really annoying. Especially, like, I don't know if you guys have been getting it. The invis glitch, where you can't see your weapons or anything. That is really, really frustrating. Doesn't have to uh, happen to me that often, personally. But uh, definitely is one of the worst glitches in the game right now. This guy using star... I'm dead. I'm dead. No, this is bad. Did we get child by this guy? Yeah, we do. There's not much I can do. I go to the left, I die. Go backwards, I die. Go forward, I die. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Give me that heavy. Don't... No! In the air headshot? That is the luckiest shit. Bro, he literally jumped and then said a prayer to the, to the AE gods and was like, Yo, Bungie, please let me hit this shot. And then he just hit it, bro. Like, dude... The AE gods, man. I actually hate how AE is even a thing, bro. Your gun should just be 100% accurate in the air. Unless it's a special weapon. We don't have enough range for this at all. We really just don't. And he's throwing down an... Oh, dude, and somebody spawns behind us. Hello? Of course, we're not going to lose to that guy. But, like, that shit is just annoying. Like, he just spawns directly behind us. Like, what are we even supposed to do about that? Dude, I'm so fu- mm, Dude, this shotgun sucks. This shotgun is so bad. Bro, like, it's actually crazy. I see anybody else, like, Billy Bob 47 use his shotgun, and it one-taps. Like, from the- From there! Like, this shotgun almost one-taps, but my Imperial Decree is doing two damage. It is literally doing two damage from there. Thank you, bro. Thank you, because I was actually about to lose my mind. Somebody just spawn in the back? I guess we have to look out for it because otherwise we're just going to literally get backshot by somebody off spawn. Really frustrating. 
Fractatus. Like, dude, Frac just one taps. Frac actually just one taps, whereas Imperial Decree just never gets the job done, apparently. That's just kind of how it is. This guy in well out here, he is. We're just not going to challenge it. I think here's what we do. We just popped on. We get a couple... We get a couple kills with Dawn. There's one guy in the back. I don't know if he's running all the way around. He's trying to jump over a shotgun. He probably... Dude, I, I can't. I can't stand this game. Dude, if I... Thank God the game's over because if I would have gotten one more late reg, bro, I would have lost my mind. That's all I'm going to say. Well, boys, there you have it. That is pretty much all the gameplay that I have for today's video. Even though I definitely lost blood flow to my brain in that last game because I was so mad. Like, y'all don't hear it a lot, but I was genuinely mad at the game, bro. Like, that does not happen very often. But, like, every time, like, hey, and by the way, I apologize, Imperial Decree. Imperial Decree is not bad, but the amount of late regs I was getting, it was just pissing me off so much I had to put on something else, bro. Because I was literally going to break my Xbox. It was that bad. But uh, overall, Nation of Beasts, I mean, the hand cannon is really, really good. Don't get me wrong. But, uh, you know, if, uh, if the game was actually working properly, I probably, you know, would have enjoyed the experience a little bit more. But as always, if you guys did enjoy this video, I would greatly appreciate it if you left a like and a comment letting me know what you thought. And if you're new around here, it never hurts hit that subscribe button. Anyways, it's been Gravely. Peace.